We met in a class. We had to take a, a couple mm. classes together, well, one class together. And she a... she actually wanted to talk to me, and she had a couple friends that would try to hook us up, and I was I wasn't going for it at the time. But um. And what I did. Oh, I can't hear. What I wrote on your arm. Oh, you wrote my number. She wrote a number <laughs> on my arm. May all of us here assembled be of that blessed company that shall enjoy the marriage supper of the Lamb. We ask these things in the only name that matters, the name of Jesus, who is our Christ. Amen. To my heart, my better half, the one that makes me better, a better man, I love you more than life itself. I vow to love you, cherish you, and provide you with the words of encouragement. I love how no matter what we have been through in life already, we stick by each other's sides. You are my best friend, you are, you are part of me. I know our marriage will not always be perfect, but as long as we stay united, we will, we will always prosper in our marriage and in life. I, I know I'm not the greatest man in the world, but I will continue to strive to become a better man throughout our lives. say that I'm happy to be with you. This is the moment we've been waiting for for a long time and I'm a bit nervous but I'm ready. I'm ready to commit to you for the rest of my life. I love you so much. I love you so much. So used to standing 
so used to being on my own, but this thing is new, babe. It feels like I'm losing control. I take another step. If you catch me when I fall for you, 'cause I. Lifeline, and without you, I feel incomplete. I vow to be corny, funny, work hard to bring a smile upon your beautiful face. I have known you so long, I can't imagine doing life without you. I vow to do stuff that makes you happy, even when it really doesn't make me happy. <laughs> but if it makes you happy, but if it makes you happy, I will. Would you do that for me? My K, my baby. <laughs> Twelve years of friendship. Ten years later, here we are. Who have thought two fourteen-year-old teenagers who have bumped into each other and fallen in love so long? That's because God had a plan for us. It's my pleasure to present to you. Mr. and Mrs. Caleb. That's the one thing I'm sure I will take this one last step. So catch me, I'm falling for you. I'm falling. I'm falling. Do your dance. 